Today, I wanted to go over um, a new feature that PropStream rolled out as part of their list automator, because I think this really establishes them as uh, I mean, one of the most valuable tools an investor should be using. Now, what this tool allows you to do, so normally if you had like a list of properties, let's say you were driving for dollars or you had an old mailing list and wanted to see, you wanted to like update that list, right? Or maybe you're driving for dollars with like pen and pad and you're trying to figure out who owns these properties. Now I wouldn't be driving for dollars by hand um, in 2020, there's Deal Machine and all kinds of other cool apps that can do that for you. But assuming that you've got a list um, that uh, you're looking to figure out who owns them and what kind of equity they have, right? Um, I do this on my niche lists and I used to go to the assessor site, find the person's you know, name, um, mailing info, all of that. And then I would try to find public records for what they bought the property for and then try to run that against the Zestimate to try to determine if they had equity. And that's just super, super labor intensive. So PropStream rolled out the ability with their list automator that I think is something like 30 bucks that allows you to actually get all of PropStream's data out on those properties. So, you know, another thing you could do is maybe search properties one at a time, you know, do something like this and you know go through pull up the particular lead pull the info out add it to an excel spreadsheet um, or add it to a list and then export that list right but pretty labor intensive so this is the formatting that they use um, how you do this you're going to go into the my properties section and uh, you're going to use this import list button now, when you click on this, it will give you um, the template that you can download right there. But for the sake of this example, I wanted to be able to show you everything on one screen. So this is just a small list of 44 properties that we're going to, uh, all we have is the address and we're gonna figure out who owns them um, and all that other good stuff. So I have this on my computer as a file. Uh, we're gonna call this, demo, click save, and this will kind of start the processing. So uh, 42 properties saved, so not too bad. There was only two that they missed, but we can now go into this file and see all of this info, literally just like that. Um, all the way down to, you know, equity percentage, you know, loan to value, um, if it's been listed, who owns it, what they paid, all that good stuff. And then you can simply click this, export it, and send it out to your mail house. This is a really, really cool feature, um, particularly if you're not wanting to repurchase lists or data that you've already bought. Let's say maybe you used something um, like list source to purchase a list of seniors with equity, right? It's one of the only lists I'm still buying through list source just because uh, PropStream doesn't have demographic info. And let's say I bought that list two or three months ago and I wanna know, hey, have any of these sold? I can literally refresh the data set in just a couple seconds like you saw there. And uh, it just goes out of your um, like typical account. So. If we go into here, this is settings, it'll tell you how many downloads slash imports you have remaining for the month and how many exports you have. Um, there's several other data tools that I pay for, really flows one of them. Um, we use list, force, list source for some stuff, but I think PropStream rolling out the ability to basically be able to pull everything they have in their database on any single address is huge. Uh, so really, really neat feature. I do have an affiliate link for them that I will drop below. Um, if you don't know what that means, basically if you use it, I get a commission um, for anybody who signs up under it. So if you found this helpful, appreciate you using it. Um, but honestly, this is just a tool we're using inside of our own business. Um, if uh, you don't wanna use my link and wanna use the tool, I highly recommend it. So feel free to check it out. Um, let me know kind of your thoughts below if this is something you've tried or what you've seen. 
but we've been really, really impressed with kind of this new addition that came with the list automator part of the software.